Whilst the Tunis have been crowned CAF Champions League winners for the third time in their history. The Tunisian side is the new club champion of Africa after staging a historic, historic fight back to beat eight-time winners Al Ahli on Friday. Esperance overturned a 3-1 deficit from the first leg in Cairo to win the return leg 3-0 in front of their home fans in Rades. Adnan Shawashi tells us more. Esperance Sportive de Tunis beat Al Ahli to win its third CAF Champions League. Saad Abgir was the two-goal star. Anis Badri completed the scoring to give Esperance a 4-3 aggregate victory. Saad was a reserve for most of the competition. He played in the second leg of the final because of Frank Combs' suspension. We scored fast and we did it. Esperance dominated the match. The blood and gold team had lost the first leg, 3-1 in Burj Al Arab Stadium in Alexandria, with Al Ahli converting two penalties. Al Ahli's penalties were controversial, but our three goals here in Rade Stadium were clean. We're proud African champions. The remontada was extraordinary. Tens of thousands of people took to the streets of the capital city Tunis and many regions across the country to celebrate the victory. We've put a new star on our t-shirt. We thank the players and the technical staff. They were brave and showed what Tunisians can do. Esperance booked its place at next month's FIFA Club World Cup in Abu Dhabi as CAF's representative as well as the CAF Super Cup. OST said in a communique that celebrations will continue until the 15th of January. The Blood and Gold team will celebrate its centennial here in Bebeswika, the birthplace of the African champion which made history with stunning comeback against Al Ahli. Adam Shawashi, CGTN, Tunis.